So, it is Hiroshi Shibe, and welcome to Satoshi's Treasure Hunters. And happy Clue Day, everybody. Um, it's been a bit of a wild ride. I've uh, had actually do this recording three times, and <laughs> each time there seems to be a new update, but I'm just going to stick with just the Clue announcement and save all the trials and tribulations and solutions and any news uh, for our weekly wrap up. But for just for today, I'm just going to announce hey, we have a clue. Um, I'm just going to call it the rabbit key. It's it, it's a name I can't pronounce. It's like Laponi. Laponi. It means hair. So, rabbit key. Uh, the name of the key was actually revealed like Saturday, like somewhere in the middle of the night, I believe, or at least that's when I uh, became aware of it. Uh, and the actual clue for that key was revealed not at noon Pacific Standard Time, as the website says. Uh, it was revealed through the newsletter, which they did state, you know, they put it out there that the, the, the newsletter, if you subscribe, you might get a little heads up. And the SMS message, which um, up to this point, I haven't heard of anybody receiving any text messages if they provided their phone number. Uh, but it will be interesting to see if and when that happens, if they they get a heads up different, or they get a different code to a key, or, you know, it will be interesting to see how the game makers, you know, conduct this game. But for today, we have the the rabbit key okay so 10 13 a.m pacific standard time i received you know a little notice a little alert on my email and it states that hey the key is up i'm like what the key is up so i checked the site stoshi treasures.xyz and sure enough the clue for the key is up and so let's go to the site let's look at uh what we have here okay so nope that's not it there it is. So right there. Uh, and why is the date there? Okay, so <coughs> Satoshi's treasure. Uh, right here at the very bottom here is the rabbit key for 21, 2019. Unknown if it's been found. Follow the cra the the crazy rabbit, which is you know very similar to the now everything's all wonky it's very similar to you know the matrix or alice in wonderland and plus today is if you celebrate it easter sunday so here we have the clue we came early uh unexpected i actually wanted to do like a little live stream revelation but <laughs> that didn't happen and considering it's taken me three times to record the same announcement I'm um, kind of glad that maybe noon wasn't the revelation. Uh, I did actually look and see if there were more keys that were going to be released at uh, 12 Pacific Standard Time, but no, that wasn't the case. So if you click on Follow the Rabbit, basically, uh, it has this statement. And it's, uh, congratulations to the hunters who congregated their locations indicated in my first transmission and found the first keys of the hunt. A hearty congratulations as well to the, to the few who realized that, they, that to travel in the meat states was not entirely necessary to find those keys. While parts of the hunt are solitary endeavors, most of the time you will need to work together as a clan and pull, to pull ahead. The real challenge is available, solvable, for an individual only at a considerable expense. For a group is nothing but a simple test at uh, cohesion and trust. Uh, in my hunt, and as in my life, remember that nothing is what it seems. So again, it's, you know, these little statements are happening on the website. Uh, again, this game is supposed to be played within a group. But you also can be individuals. I guess it can say is a testament of whether or not how cooperative people are going to be with um, money on the line. So if you click the link, um, we get a very interesting clue. Uh, I would say I would describe the clue as something that is very reminiscent of the early aughts. Uh, something that 
you might have seen very early, uh, like I said, in the early last round, I would say 04 or 05, the style of the particular GIF that is the clue. I, um, I'm not sure if it's actually something that's taken from um, a publicly available piece of media. Uh, it'd be interesting to know if it's actually attached to maybe a show or a movie or somehow it is associated uh, with anything particular, maybe a video game. Uh, it just it seems vaguely familiar at the same time. It just I don't personally know what to make of it, but it was it was an interesting clue, if you will. So here it is. I'm gonna blow it up for you. You have this GIF that repeats, like GIFs are supposed to do, of this rabbit and. Yeah, um, like I said, the style is kind of grainy, so it looks very similar to something we would see in the arts and early gift making, if you will, or the style of makers of the time, the, the, the technology they had available. Um, the animation is from that era, if you will, as well, I would say. Um, I don't know if it has anything to do with helping it to solve the, the clue, but... Um, so there you have it. Um, don't know what to make of it. You know, I am part of a clan. Um, I'll reveal that um, uh, when I do the, the weekly rundown. But it's just, I'm, I'm very excited. Um, I like seeing the different dynamics on the different social platforms and the different way people are engaging with one another. Uh, it'll be interesting to see how quickly the, the clue is solved, uh, if it's going to take all week, if it's going to be like hours or, or even very fast. Uh, the game makers have stated that they were going to adjust their game as, you know, we've proven ourselves to be, you know, clever, uh, able to solve the the um, clues. I, I hope they do get harder. I hope it takes a while, maybe like a week or two or a month. Again, we're very early on. There's only four keys released so far out of the potential 400 that you need to combine together to, to achieve, but there could be, you know, it's, it's, it's stated that there's a thousand keys, so it could be 401. It could be 522, and then someone solves it. It could be 637. It could be actually at 400, you know, all the first 400 keys, and bam, you have the reward. But, uh, you know, we'll see. Uh, we'll see how it progresses. I would like to see some more real-world um, feats, if you will, as I say, feats of strength or feats or something, uh, task, if you will, to get people, you know, to go out there, uh, to be more global, so it's not quite as instantaneous, if you will, that it takes more cooperation, and you have to have the resources, or the clan, or know people, or start going on the network, or finagling and haggling, or something like that, to uh, accomplish tasks. Uh, I also like to see something that's not necessarily, like, not tech base, but something that even the average layperson could maybe f kind of figure out or kind of get in. I don't know. It would be nice to see something like a high, uh, what's that app, HQ trivia, <laughs> you know, weird trivia question or something. I don't know. It would be, I would like to see some different dynamics of game playing, if you will, happening. Um, but who knows? Uh, they they said they have prizes, so all sorts of you know concepts and prizes, and are willing to adjust. And so we'll see how their adjustments go. Uh, but that's it for clue day. Um, just one key. Uh, we'll see how the rest of the keys are dispersed. Uh, we might get another key later this week. We might again get it um, like basically every Sunday. Supposedly this is supposed to only take a year to do this game. But again. Uh, the Legend of Satoshi took three years for people to solve, so we'll see. But I'm Hiroshi Shine. That's it for now. This is Satoshi's Treasure Hunters. Uh, tune in on Friday, in which we will uh, break down the week and whether it's you know 
you know, we'll talk about uh, the clans they're still advertising for people to join, uh, the different uh, official channels that are available so people know to get the correct information. We'll talk about the clue this week. Uh, kind of break down how it was solved, um, if that's publicly available, how it was solved, uh, what the key is. Uh, talk about uh, what we expect from the game, I guess you can say. Uh, any rules or tidbits or anything like that. Um, and I would say, uh, I kind of want like at the end of the episode, like either the clue of the week or the like the unique solution of the week or maybe the the thing to do next if you're out there like you know my idea the community's idea what to do next as to progress further into the game uh but that's it for now uh, i hope you enjoy this little quick blurb and i will see you friday to the hunt <laughs>